Hey guys and welcome back to another episode of Red Roof Gaming. So today we are going to do something a little bit different. Excuse me while I just move that thing on the other screen so I can see my notes. Um, so we're actually going to make ourselves a enclosure for our horses. Now we've got these two horses that we've managed to somehow entice into our base. Um, but we don't really have anywhere to keep them. So what I've done is I've kind of killed those cows that were in that original story area, cow yard thing. Um, and I've relocated them to a new home. So what we're going to do is, and I've, sorry, reconfigured that into a new home for the horses. So what we're going to do today is, well, put a gate on it, a big, brick gate on it um, and in order to make it easier to get the horses out we are going to make the aforementioned gate have a big piston door so for that and I'm going to move pretty much all of my tools off my taskbar in order to do this now the first thing we're going to need, uh, we're going to need some of these redstone, project redstone, um, I'm going to call them circuit boards, I don't know what else to call them. So the first thing we need is one of these timers. Now if I actually go up into this and, cl and clear that out, I should be able to, I've done it again. Okay, so, what do we need? Nope, because we haven't made any of these in a while. So, that's a problem. Mm, that is actually a problem. Our uh, new sorting system doesn't leave us with any. smooth stone. Uh, best solution for that is probably to go in here. Okay, let me solve the smooth stone problem and I will probably fast forward through it. Let me solve this smooth stone issue and I will be right back. Oh yes, we made those. Let's see if we can make these. More than we needed. And this one. This one is the one I'm not sure. I have enough in the system to do it. Cool. Uh, let's go with the one of those. Ah, question mark. Phil. Thank you. Now we also need a couple of LATCH. Toggle latch. Oh. Toggle latches. Seemingly simple. I know these are not hard to make. I just don't have any at the moment. Do I actually have enough? <laughs> oh, yes. I don't have enough for two, though. So what do we need? We need the wire thingies and the light bulb thingies. Light bulb thingies. Oh. Wire thingies. Mark fill, and we have our two toggle latches. Cool. Uh, 
you and you can go in there. Now, I want a, a button, but I actually want one of these ones. No. Oh. Okay, what about a green one? There. Okay. A green one. Okay, I'm gonna use the two. There are any buttons in the system? Okay. Let's make the button. And then... Okay, there's our light up green button. Now I do have. We're going to need. Three different colors. So that's fine. Um. Probably need all 16 of that. And we're going to need some more stone bricks. So. Let's take a set of 64 and a set of 32. Should give us what we need. Oh, we need to make pistons. Pistons. Sticky pistons. We actually might have enough stuff for this. That's one side, one, two, three, four. So eight pistons. And then we can probably do the rubber ones. Oh, yes. We have enough. Oh, and there's some... Re... I reinforced glass left from when I made those other things. Cool. I'm going the wrong way. Okie dokie. So, oops, my jetpack is flat. I need to recharge my jetpack. I'll just do a little fast forwarding here again. Okie dokie, so the area that we're actually going to make this in, my mouse is getting a little touchy today, is right here. Now you can see I've started doing a little bit of the, the, the ground work, per se. I just realised I forgot a pr two pressure plates. Um, fortunately, right through this door here, oh I didn't pick up that chest. Right here through this door is a couple more of these, so let's go... Okay, so that's that sorted. Okay, so it's a pretty simple design. Let me just lay out the groundwork. So that'll be there. I'm going to cut a hole through here. Pre I, I may have pre-built some of the under underground part of it. Okay, so there will be eight sticky pistons eight sticky pistons four on either side of the door and that'll be a hole so one two you know what, there's an easy way to do this. Three. Four. Now it's actually, we're making, actually making this a little bit bigger than I had intended. On making this thing. 
but that is life. As you can see, I started hauling out bits and pieces and places that I thought we wouldn't need. I'm not probably not going to have enough of this redstone. Alloy wire. Yeah, I will make myself have enough. Okay, so... That will be there. And then if we put a hole here... Because we are going to have a little pillar that comes off of here... With our... I should not have put that in yet, because we need to put that, that, that... That and then that in. With our button. On the other side. When you press the button, it lights up. Activates our redstone signal. Okay, so down here. This is probably the most complicated part of this entire system. Now I am also realizing that... I will need one more little piece of equipment. So, we could do this without it, but I'm really hoping we actually have some. Yes, we have some bundle wire. Now, I only need one piece of this bundle wire. Um, Basically, our primary operation line has to cross over our trigger line. So in order to do that, the easiest way I have found to do that is to use a single piece of that. And it is literally that simple. There's our trigger line. We're running around the outside of this. Wow, my mouse is very touchy all of a sudden. Okay, so that's our trigger line. That is the doors. Now, I've got my math correct. Actually, I need to dig this out. Because right above that there... Yes. This is our trigger line for... Oops, wrong one. Those. Now, this is the complicated and tricky bit. I need that there, and then nope, all wrong. You there, and then you there. Then I need to take. that light out. <laughs> and I've done it wrong again. Okay, red control line will come off of that. This will go up to about six seconds. Um, this guy will link. No, that's why we didn't. Why we moved it over. That guy will link those two. Fudge McMuffin. Can I be really, really cheeky and put you there? Yes, I can. Now that I just do this. We're wasting wire. Okay, put that there. Put that there. Oh, right. <laughs> that, that, and that. 
me boo booed. Okay, so now what we have is we step on a pressure plate or press the button, this triggers. The counter starts. Six seconds later, that's wrong. Okay, so I've successfully done something wrong. Um, oh, right, this is the yellow line. <laughs> okay, so we then do that. So that should be the time. So we step on a pressure plate or press the button. This spins and disables that, like so. So to actually see it in operation, we have to go up. that toggle switch is in the wrong position. So, I press the button. Six seconds later, that door closes again. And six seconds feels like forever. of this piece of architecture here was its aim to do that. But we can't do that. Yes, we can. We just have to go up one more. And we are now taller than the building beside it. So we're not going to do that. We're just going to do this. And we actually haven't made any stairs. Fooey. There's a whole heap of stairs right there. And that is all of our stairs. Okay, so our next mission is to right, hey, let's fill in that floor. So there we have it. There is our door. It's big, it's narrow, but we should be able to fit a horse and us through that door hopefully in six seconds. I think I've just discovered an issue with this little mechanism. So what we're going to do is we're going to try something a little bit different here. We are actually going to swap this wire with a piece of red wire. 
which will not work either. Bolt. I need a way. Oh, look, for the time being, let's do it this way. It works. We can get through it. And I will figure out a solution for this system that hopefully won't kill us as we bring our horses through. Maybe we put a button on, the, on this side, which is probably the easiest solution in retrospect. Okay, so I have apples on me, right? Oh, I'm having some real lag today. Oh, the world back up. This is happening. Quite possibly just happening. Okay, so let's dump these extra bits of equipment and stuff. I don't have charcoal on me. Back into the system. Grab our usual bits and pieces out. STA. So, stone brick stairs. Once. Let's just. Four sets of 64. That should be tons. I shouldn't need, like, two sets of those. Hell, I shouldn't need more than one set of these. And there we have it, our horse gate. So, that was fun. Um, I really love doing these redstone, um, I would call them redstone mazes, but they're not really redstone mazes, are they? They're more, yeah. Anyway, I really like doing this sort of stuff. Um, so we might try and do a little bit more redstone. I mean, I don't know how we're going to get the horses out of the gate. We may have to make another gate just for horses. Didn't actually want to go out of you. And now I've left the gate open. For night time. Like, come on, man. Um, anyway. We will probably have to make another gate for the horses. Um, because I don't... Uh, we might be able to... No, I'll have to make another gate. Hey guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did like the video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up down the bottom there. If you didn't enjoy the video, well, hopefully we'll have something coming up shortly more up your alley. So hit subscribe and we'll see you next time here on Red Root Gaming.